Hey guys, Mr. Mike's 21. Today I am back in Call of the Wild after a little break. And we're going to be going out today to try to hunt for some geese. We're actually going to head up into the tundra area, try to get some bean geese and some Canada geese. Let me just swap out my guns real quick here. Don't remember what I was hunting last time I was in. Alrighty, so I'll show my, I know I showed my decoy spread a little bit in my um, exploring video, but these guys are far closer. For almost all the ducks, this little stretch of water here is one of the better spots, so I just kind of set up in this little cove right along the coast, and I've set up right kind of uh, by this uh, outpost is the best spots to get your gray lag geese and some Canada geese. But by far, if you're trying to do really, really well with geese, way up in here. So I am well out by this uh, lookout tower. So we're gonna fast travel out there. And I'm gonna change the time to hmm, 6 a.m. That tends to be the best time just to kinda start to get things rolling 6 a.m. or a little bit before. Otherwise, you head out and your decoy spread's already full of geese. I'm going to take a quick nap. Okay. There we go. It's a little worried we wouldn't have more come in. That's a pretty good Canada. Have not gotten a diamond Canada goose or diamond tundra bean on this map yet. The only one I have is a gray lag. So any level fives are very welcome. And they are just circling in a spot where I can't see them. Well, that looks like a devoted land. We got a three, two. Well, their land. 
standing very close to me. Okay, I'll let these guys come in real quick, but we'll assist Vic. Looks like that level one is probably, or level three right there, that's going to be the one. Go ahead and shot him. Well, that didn't go well. Luckily, they really don't seem to mind that I just ran across the field and jumped into a blind. Circling right, right above me, though. I'm just hoping they won't go down in the woods, because that'll be kind of difficult. The wind does look right for them to go and land down in the field. There is a whole bunch of them. This is already a. I guess I know this is usually a good spot. I was just hoping to get some tundra beans, but this is definitely a great spot if you want to see lots of action. And we've got some gray lags going down. I'm gonna hop up with my rifle and go ahead and pop that one right in the chest. I think I got two of them. And three of them. So certainly better luck than the tundra beans. Because I'm a glutton for running across a field. I'm going to run over there and try to pick them up real quick. Mainly just want to make sure the two were actually down. Yeah, they're down right in the road. Whenever I see gray lag geese, all I can think of are the, uh, the pilgrim geese. I had a, a friend who had a farm and he had a bunch of pilgrim geese, which... I'm sure they're probably derived from the gray lags. Very similar looking. But the geese are coming back. So let's get back in that blind. Before I scare off. Actually, those aren't even geese, are they? Oh, you do see a lot of tufted ducks on this shoreline, too. Now, waterfowl definitely tends to peek out right around mid morning. Very similar to real life. 
But at least the nice thing about this map is if you want to keep bird hunting, you can just start walking around the woods and... I mean, if you're here, you can go out and start hunting willow tarm again and hazel grouse. Or maybe if you're in the far north, maybe you start walking around on the from uh, ridge to ridge up in the tundra trying to shoot caper Kaylee. This is, uh, it really is an upland game hunter's uh, dream, this map. I wish they had had some more big game, but we get what we get, and we certainly got a lot with this. See if we can get this last flock to land. And I think I'll call it after that. They land down when they should land right off to our right. Sem oh, yep, there we go. Let's see how many want to follow. These guys look like they're coming in. So not really anything of uh, anything really big, but. They're landing about 60 yards. Alright. Let's just kind of uh, see what we got. Yeah, we're going to call that it. <laughs> I'd say that went pretty well. Got a one brown hybrid. Another brown hybrid. Yeah. down here in the woods. I don't know how far back he was. Oh, that must be him right there. I don't know, did one of the other two, did I hit it? Wow, all brown hybrids. I feel like I missed one. I thought I got four. Well guys, there might still be a lot of geese in the air, but I'm gonna call it a day here. If you guys like my content, go ahead, feel free to like and subscribe. It lets me know what you guys like. 
Uh, this was just a quick video, as uh, a lot of my videos tend to just be quick videos that end up not being so quick. But only one more video after this before Way of the Hunter. Uh, probably end up being some more pro hunts because I can't get away from the game. But as always, you guys have a great night.